Hi Taurus singles. Welcome to your val quick Valentine's forecast. Okay, now please take note that this is only a quick reading and this is not really a full out reading. All right, let's take a look Taurus if somebody will be coming your way to sweep you off your feet. Or will drive you nuts. Let's take a look. Well, Taurus. Okay. Somebody that you have left behind. Or somebody that you walked away from in the past. Which is someone younger than you. This person is going to be coming your way in an unexpected moment, unexpected time, in an unexpected place. Uh -huh. Taurus. This is a fire sign. Um, it seems like you believe before that... The moment before for the two of you aren't really right. That's why you walked away from this person. And now you are about to see each other again. Plus, you were not really determined to be with this person before. So there's like an unfinished business. Because this person is kind of waiting for the explanation. You know, like, why did you left? Why did you, you know, where did you go? What did I do wrong? Or, you know, something like that. It would, you know, like, a, has there been anybody else aside from me? You know? And I feel like you should prepare your explanation to this person because um, whether you want to go back, to, you know, wh whether you want to re reconcile with each other or whether you want to really be with each other. It seems like there's a... I feel like it's not yet over. And... You've been busy working. Okay? And even if there are some other people around you. Even if you've been trying to reach your goals and your targets. And you've been trying to prove to you, to other people, to yourself. That you can be somebody. Or that you can have a lot more money than... You know, what other people have already achieved. You still feel a little bit lonely. Okay, and um, there are a lot more things that you feel like you still want to achieve, but you don't know how and where and why do you feel like there's no contentment. Okay, there are some moments in your life that you've already achieved some of the things that people, you know, haven't really achieved, but you feel like something is missing. Which is, I feel like you have made a promise to somebody in the past that, you know, that... Mm, hmm, that you will, you know, that you ask them to wait for you. <laughs> Which is, I feel like you're, you don't even mean this. So this person have waited out for you, and now the two of you are going to be crossing your paths again, and you have to, you know, prepare your um, your explanation to this person. And next time, don't make any promises that you don't have any intention of fulfilling. Now, when you walked away, you thought that you can find another happiness in the arms of other people. Or other potentials but then what happened to you is that you kept on finding karmic connections or karmic people you know that keeps on giving you lessons here and there so actually I feel like you keep on you know you're having a hard time being faithful and loyal because you feel like you haven't really found the right one you keep on looking here and there you have waited for somebody in the past, which is an earth sign, but you feel like, you know, that that thing will never ever happen. So, this time you have to make up to this fire sign or, the, or to this younger person. And there will be a bit of a fun, you know, when it comes to your sex life. Uh, yeah, I feel like when it comes to your sex life... 
or when it comes to your sexual connection the two of you will really be connecting but when it comes to the relationship side let's take a look uh, no this is just another lesson to learn and mostly that you have to you know give this person a closure okay it's like an unfinished business but it's not really meant to be all right and right after this will you be meeting the right one okay you're the one who's going to be walking away from this person again <sighs> oh well it seems like you cannot really teach your heart who to beat for all right and let's take a look what should be you know the main lesson for you to learn about this upcoming person or relationship because i feel like there's only something that you need to finish up and to learn okay obstacle commitment focus surrender you know your main issue here okay this is only for Taurus singles your main issue when it comes to relationships is that you're so afraid of committing you're so afraid of giving yourself in and you feel like there are a lot more things okay that you want to see do feel experience you know but you keep on looking for love you keep on looking for that one person who will give everything to you and who will provide the things that you really want to have and experience in this world but it's all about sharing okay it's all about sharing your space sharing your life and sharing your resources you need to learn how to give half of you to somebody okay not to somebody who is kind of struggling or drowning in their own crisis find somebody who is already complete and someone who can also share their other half to you and not because that they want to take the other half of you all right now you also need to focus on giving yourself in or giving your best in a relationship or giving your best commitment okay because it seems like for you, love or relationship is all about sex and pleasure. And then when you feel like, ah, you know, I'm already bored. I'm not really ready for this big commitment. You feel like this person is being too clingy and needy. And that's the time that you run away. Where the fact is, you are so afraid of falling in love again. Because you are so afraid of getting hurt, getting rejected. And... You know feeling all alone again address your issues and you will find happiness all right now if you want to talk to me live on the phone or live video calls or if you want to have your own forecast you know or pre-recorded video readings go and visit me at my website at sophieangel.net blessings to you